Okay, coming on uh, south on eBay is this beautiful Range Rover Vogue autobiography with the Oma Finch body kit. Let me start with the front. As you can see, we've got carbon fiber grill, box skirt, along with the spotlight housing. ageless. As you can see there's no scrapes or dents. On the rear here again we've got the over finch and we've also got carbon fibre fin and inlay and the over finch rear tailpipes on the exhaust. You can see it's a beautiful car. Carry on walking around you can see the tyres and the wheels Glass. There is one scrape on the wheel, which only happened last week. And that's here. Um, and that's that. It's got spacious. As you can see, and I'll throw in the uh, I'll throw in the cover and protector. It's got a rubber protector as well. Spare wheel, changing kit, controls for the seats on there, as you can see, and a boot divider there. It's also got a power point at the back. This comes with a, it's a V8 diesel engine, 4,367cc. We've got the cream leather interior. As you can see, beautiful. It's absolutely my favourite. With the black piano ivory inlays on the inside. Black leather finish. I just think it's uh, absolutely beautiful. Okay, rear entertainment system, and because it's long wheel base, look, you can see how much space there is. Absolutely loads. Electric seats, so your, uh, I'll put the uh, ignition on for them to work. Um, in this, I will throw in two remote controls and the headsets for the media center. And we've also got passengers can control their own heating on their heated seats, cooling seats, their climate control, um, as well as I've, uh, they've also got a cup holder within there, and there is actually another one in here, and a little console bit, again, for the mock control. On there. Okay, as you can see, no rips or scratches, in very good order. Got over finch custom mats as well with the cream piping match the car perfectly and start the car up so we've got the two doors open at the moment and obviously no seat belt but as you can see no warning lights on apart from seat belt which we'd expect and we've got that little i shut the doors just so you can see that triangle go out And that is the mileage. Current mileage, 46,077. This car isn't used daily, so it won't go up much more than that. We've got the wide touchscreen media pad, lots of built-in apps. Need to order manual. There's lots and lots to this. Lots and lots and lots to this. Okay. Ambient lighting change, etc. And then you've got the centre console there that adjusts all the variants of the four-wheel drive system. 
as well as the uh, automatic suspension and it is an automatic which is the Dahlia automatic uh, parking brake there. On the steering wheel we've got adaptive um, driving so lane control and departure built into the mirrors. Uh, you can set the um, adjustment of the vehicle in front so that you can maintain a safe distance as well as cruise control, heated steering wheel and you can also control the entertainment system from here. So uh, yeah that's that. So uh, your seats, each one is operated separately and you've got your temperature, you can go cold or you can go hot and on the fronts you can actually set massage too which is nice and on the rear you can operate the temperature and the rear passengers can also do that uh, you also have your built-in camera it also does have your 360 camera built in to see that all the way around the car and it's actually uh, yeah cracking just a cracking car you can individually select sides back front so yeah loads of features loads and loads of features to play with there so comes with logbook and we have the uh, I've printed off the online service history so it's a full dealer service history I've just had an MOT on it comes with a book pack the overfinch manual and not one but two keys it is remote entry, I'll show you again in a second, um, as well as you can use the key fobs themselves. Two glove boxes, and there's the security nut for the wheels, another one there. We've got two cup holders there, and in here you can plug in a variety of different media centres to the TV. Uh, as well as actually have a call box which is just underneath here which will be empty you can actually put the television on on the front here as well that does actually act as a tv screen you do need to subscribe um, to a, a system for it to work um, where you can actually put a sim card there for data or you can actually plug it in there and there's the dvd slot if you want to watch television there. So we have, so grab a key. So we do have deployable steps there. Track there. And you can actually, instead of using the key, you can just Each door is soft closed as well, as you can see there. Same for the backs. And then, it's plugged in, that's from the MOT. I put the screens on for you at the back, actually. I'm trying to do this in one continuous video so that you can see there are no, no edits. And everything works as it should. So bear with me. Rear screens, which you can operate with the remote controls, which are here, as you can see, and then you can just adjust what you want on there. And then you've got media outlets at the bottom there, HDMI, so you can put um, an entertainment Xbox, PlayStation, anything you like, really. Okay, and these live in there. As you can see, they are fully adjustable on all of them. And so you've got your privacy glass there. And you've also got not only windows, but you have actually got privacy blinds that operate on the same button as the window. Okay. And there is the panoramic roof, which does also close using this button here. Up 
one there actually. So yeah, that closes totally if you want that shut. Okay, I can't think of anything else to show you. Um, you can also operate it with an app, uh, so you can start your car in the mornings. Um, it will also tell you the distance it is and it has got a built-in tracker, but again, that's a subscription service that you do need to tie into. Um, and that's it, this, uh, this beautiful car is for sale. Um, the starting price is actually the lowest price I'll go, so please uh, don't waste our time with uh, offering less. If at the end of the auction it hasn't sold, then I will relist it at a lower price uh, and only at that point. Um, if there is anything I haven't covered, then feel free to ask them uh, via the message service on eBay. Uh, oh, it does have um, another thing I did forget on sports mode, um, and you actually have got paddle controls on the steering wheel. Um, no, nope, can't think of anything else. Stop, start, and that's that. So, uh, there we are then. We have the Range Rover Vogue autobiography with the Overfinch body kit, V8, turbo diesel engine, 4,367cc, in black. Absolutely stunning vehicle and very, very rare.